Maria Moranti, Hi, how are I'm you? I'm doing well, thanks. How are you? I'm great. I'm so glad Good. you welcomed us into your beautiful neighborhood. Uh, I want to tell you your stores are one of my favorite places to be. How nice. Thank so you. So tell us a little bit about um, how long you've been in Bloomfield, what you love about it. Ah, uh, well, I really do love everything about the neighborhood. It's just, um, it, it's a community and it is a neighborhood. You can walk down the street, see people you know, mm -hmm. still talk to each other. You know, just just a simple hi. Whereas some places, you know, you, you're we're out of that. So right. this is still a community, which is great. I've been here almost 20 years. Wow. Yeah, Beautiful. the shop is 30 years old. I was in Oakland first, okay. and because of the type of shop that I have, um, the neighborhood has been known as Little Italy through the years. And I have an Italian theme shop, so we belonged here, so to speak. And um, we're just having fun doing what we do. So it's, <laughs> I love it. it's, it's, I it's love a good it. time to come to work every day. Well, if there was something you would change about Bloomfield, what would it be? Well, you know, the, every place has a little thing here and there that you could change. I mm -hmm. think I'd like to see the avenue a little bit more um, spruced up more welcoming, you know, um, and just to start, let's getting the word out there that we're a fun place to be. Our image, our people are changing, our image is changing, and we want people to know that, it, that it's... What kind of changes are you talking about? Well, we have a much younger community ah. now. We have a more diverse community now, mm -hmm. which, is, which is great. My dad was an immigrant, so he was new here at some point, too. Right. And um, those are the kind of things that we think that we should get out to the city to let them know that we're moving along with all the different changes, too. Well, I know that this is a major thoroughfare, so you've got great transportation. Yes. You think that serves your, your community well? Yes, yeah. very much so. Um, we have a festival, a big, a big street festival for three days in September. This year it'll be in August. But um, we get more people that drive through while we're setting up our tents and everything, and then they come back for the weekend. <laughs> so, you know, that there's a lot of traffic going up and down Liberty Avenue. Here. It's great. Yeah. <laughs> a little too much to eat, but a lot of fun. <laughs> Work it off later. Work uh, it that's off later. all. That's it. What, where do you see Bloomfield in 25 years? Well, I, I think there's a, there's a big, long future here. Because of the young people that are coming into the community now with lots of children, they can start a new family-based community, right. which is great. So we can still keep a family-oriented neighborhood in the city. You know, it, it doesn't have to be... Years ago, it, it was kind of cool to move out to the suburbs. Right, but, right. But now we can stay in the city with, with lots of young families. That'll keep us going for a long time. That'll keep you going for a long Heck time. Heck yeah, sure will. yeah. <laughs> if you were to go to another neighborhood in Pittsburgh, and you say, I, I admire that, and I would like to see that in Bloomfield, or I don't want that in Bloomfield. What neighborhood would that be, and why? Well, without, um, let's just put it this way. I'm glad that, that the city has so many unique neighborhoods. Mm -hmm. We each have our own thing. So it, it's fun to go um, to Polish Hill, Mm -hmm. Or up into up to Garfield, that's that's so developing now, and over to Shady Side. We each have something different to offer, so it's fun to go, you know, check those things out, and and fun for people to come here and see how different we are. So you'd say um, one of Bloomfield's assets is that it is it has its own uniqueness. Yeah, we're we're characters. We have our own characters. <laughs> I like the way you put that, Maria. I really do. I really we have do. our own characters. I really do. Um, if you were to, say, if you were to move move away, move your business move, where would you move to? Wouldn't be Oakland. I don't know. I don't really feel like I belong anywhere else. The, the neighborhood's a perfect fit for me. Wonderful. You know, so I like it here. We've been here a long time. I feel very at home here. And um, we've worked very hard in the shop to convey that feeling. We try to make it more an experience of, you know, we sell things for your home. Right, right. So we want you to feel at home when you come in. Right. You know, because you're, you're taking things to the place that you love. So we want you to start loving it while you're there. Beautiful. So. That's Maria, it. I've really enjoyed talking oh, nice. to you. Thank you. Thank Chase. you for inviting Thank us. Thank you. Oh to my Bloomfield. gosh, we're so glad you're here. Thank you so much. Come and have a cup of coffee and some cookies. Okay. <laughs>